Hi folks, I'm Caden Alenka. Just remember, whenever you become lost, look to your journal or map for guidance. <laughs> Thank you, and have a pleasant day. Thank you, Caden. <laughs> Creepy motherfucker. <laughs> Oh, wait. Did I level up again? Oh, thank God, I leveled up again. Yeah. All right. Well, we're here at the Caden screen where, we're, where we can Caden or Caden. Uh, this Caden needs a bit more Caden, I think. I think. Just a little bit more Caden. Yeah. A little bit more Cadence. Oh. You have to unlock the Caden to get the Caden. Okay. Got it. Okay. So we Caden or Caden. So let's Caden. Okay. Onward. Sarah. Nihilus. What's up, dog? This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. There he goes. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Oh. What is that? Off in the distance. It's a ship. Look at the size of it. Got the chatter red too. It's so red and warbly. I want to watch it take off. There it goes. I'm just the Phantom of the Opera song is playing in the head right now, like as it's rising up for some reason. And then it wee <laughs> It just disappear disappears as the smoke stays the same size. It's just like from the color of that smoke I think it to be Yeah. Can I punch things? I forgot if I enabled the punch button. I don't remember if I enabled the punch button or not. I'm just swapping through my weapons really quick. What was the keybind for punching things? Caden, what was the keybind for punching things? Oh, I don't know, boss. I'm thinking about it. Uh. There is no keybind for punching things. No, that means. Attack? No, that's. Oh, that's orders. Yeah, that's orders. So there's no melee in this game? There is, but the way the melee works is. Let me let me see if I'm let me see if I'm, I'm alright about this. I'll actually run up to them to test it. It's like a quick time. No 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 no. Never mind. Fuck. Whoa. Yep. Ooh. Don't stand next to that or that. That'd be bad. Okay. We'll test it later. But I think the way the melee works in the first game is actually um. It's the same as shooting, but when you're close to someone, you'll stop shooting and just start meleeing. Oh. So it just becomes the same button. Huh, okay. Which isn't super helpful in most situations. Okay. Uh, go all the way up here. Everybody stay calm out there. We're coming out, we're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? It's safe. They're gone. I wish I could say both of that. But, uh... You can only answer one question. Stop right there! They already stopped, Shepard. <laughs> it's safe. You're okay now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Uh, I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. Knew it was trouble the second I saw it, so we made a break for the sheds. Um, investigate. Attack details. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that. We survived. If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance. That is that is actually a really good voice to match that dorky haircut. <laughs> it is. We don't know. They could have survived. Don't you know. 
Prothean beacon. Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. This ship. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. Yeah, tell them about it the was noise. Some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. Almost made it impossible to think. All right, bye. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you gotta learn when to shut up. I don't like being lied to. If there's something you're not telling me. Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. That's why you ran down here. You greedy bastard. <laughs> you weren't running for your life. You were running to check on your merchandise. No, it's not like that. I just... I just knew there were some packages here, something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. <laughs> Shake him down. <laughs> Shake him down. I'm only going to ask this once. Think long and hard before you lie to me again. <laughs> Are you sure all you've got is one lousy pistol? Uh, no, no wait, I just remembered. <laughs> I, I just had it in my pocket. Might as well take that, too. That's everything, really. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is the part where I'm glad I took both conversation paths because I wouldn't answer with this. That's too much. Mm. He might have something to do with this whole attack, Cole. We need his name. It's important. Yeah, okay, you're right. His name's Powell. Works the docks at the spaceport if he's still alive. All right, that's about all we need to know then. I have to go. So, what did he give you? He gave us a, a weapon com upgrade. A combat sensor. Okay. Yeah. Normally, he just gives us the stinger pistol. For a second, he's, he's, he said he had it in his pocket. I'm like, is he actually giving us money? <laughs> no, he's giving us a, a mod, which is a lot more valuable than the stupid pistol. Um, I'm actually gonna equip that. It's really good. But I'm also going to go to Caden, and we're going to have him equip this lovely pistol. Because we don't use pistols. Psst. We don't need that. Um, and Ashley gets nothing, because Ashley gets nothing. She could get something, but I'm going to give it to Caden. <laughs> so you can only give each person a unique item? Like, once that item is given to one person, the other ones can't use it? I think so. Wait a minute. Oh, that's just heavy armor. She can't wear that anyway because it's racially exclusive. I forgot yeah, about that. Only. All right. Let's make another save. You can give it to Nihilus. He could really use it. Yeah, Nihilus. Head. Nihilus needs that in the head. About ten minutes ago. Yeah. A little late on the uh, on giving that to Nihilus, but <laughs> well, it's thought that counts, I guess. Medical kit. Look, dead body. Something's moving over behind those crates. Oh, it's Wait, just me. don't, don't shoot! I'm one of you. I'm human. Prove it. Y you, <laughs> coward! Man, he could have done something. I like the way you hid behind those crates during the fight. Really helped us out. Thanks a lot. <laughs> me? But, but I'm just a dock worker. I don't even have a weapon. You oh, could try okay. to kill him with a forklift. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. Other one? What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. And then what? Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. Hmm. I think Cole mentioned you. You're Cole's contact here on the docks for the smuggling ring. Ooh. What? 
But no! <laughs> I mean, what does it matter now? So I'm a smuggler, who cares? My supervisor's dead, the entire crew's dead. Doesn't matter now, does it? Smuggle any weapons? Anything hidden nearby that we could use against the Geth? A shipment of grenades came through last week. Nobody notices if a few small pieces go missing from the military orders. You greedy son of a bitch. We're out here trying to protect your sorry ass, and all you can think about is how you can rip us off? I never thought you'd actually need those grenades. Who'd want to attack Eden Prime? We're just a bunch of farmers. How was I supposed to know? <laughs> You're pathetic. I'm judgmental. Hand over those grenades. Now. They're yours. Take them. My smuggling days are over, I swear. <laughs> wow, you can really press into these people. Um, you're lying? Well, I don't uh, know. I don't know. He sounded rather convinced. I mean, everybody he's worked with has died. <laughs> yeah, basically. That's some life-altering stuff. I think he should make amends. A lot of Marines died here, Powell. Those grenades could have come in handy. If I were you, I'd think of some way to make it up to them. Yeah, uh, okay. There is something else I was saving. Could be worth a fortune. Experimental technology, top of the line. Wow, what? Take it. I don't need it. I didn't want anyone to get hurt. Really, I'm sorry. I wish I could pick the other option. <laughs> like, shit. By the way, uh, I did have this, and he, like, puts a BFG on top of the crate. <laughs> I didn't think anybody would need it. We're just farmers. I would be like, um, yeah. You are an asshole. You could have killed the guy that shot my friend. <laughs> um, I don't even, I, I don't really know what he gave us yet, but, um, all right. I think I know everything I want to know about the attack and the beacon and the ship. I just kind of want to go do we something We need to about find it. that beacon before it's too late. You think it's possible that... Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. You think it's possible that Saren actually, uh... I can't stay here. His translator is malfunctioning. He's not actually after the beacon. He thinks there's a giant crate full of bacon. <laughs> And he's doing everything in his power to get his hands on it. I'm so hungry. Uh, by the way, it was a grenade upgrade, so I feel less angry at that guy, considering that's all it was. Mm. Now, not it, a very precise instrument. Yeah. Grenades. Well, I mean, it's an upgrade. You can't exactly throw an upgrade at someone. Yeah. But we can definitely use that because that'll add a lot more punch to our grenades. All right. <clears throat> So let's save again, because I like to save often, because bad things happen all the time. Good policy. Is there an autosave feature in this game? There is, but even so, I just like to do it anyway for the sake of uh, not losing any progress. Oh god. I almost died. That was the almost death screen. Oh. Yeah, our health doesn't automatically regenerate in this game, so we kind of have to watch our med stuff. She has incredible control. That crouch walk. <clears throat> yeah, it's kind of like... Wait, shields don't regenerate? No, health doesn't regenerate. Oh, oh. Like, if something takes off my... Oh, Jesus. Yeah, you need meta jump. Oh my god. Well, oh, there wait. goes Ashley. There's no Metagel in this game, is there? There is Metagel. Oh, okay. But... I thought um, I thought Metagel replaced on me, John. If someone dies, they don't come back up. Oh, like at all? There's nothing you can do about it? Yeah. Actually, um... Caden, can you... Hit the throw button. We need to toss that Geth. Uh, where's the words? There we go. And oh, they're up there on the... Yeah. Okay. Let's just, just throw that guy. He needs to go away. Um. And then he'll do it. Okay. There we go. Your health is low. I'm aware. <clears throat> I really need to get some uh, points in that there health regen. Hmm. Oh, there we go. Okay, now it's starting to kick back in. And this guy's running. Oh, Jesus. 
<laughs> Whoa! He came he up big. on me! He was pissed! I did not even know he was that big. He was so far away, I thought he was just a regular Geth. <laughs> he was massive. He was unamused at our situation. I'm glad I saved. Mm. Oh, yeah. All the way back here. Yeah. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Don't die again. The very start of this game is really difficult. You have to play to cover a lot. And I didn't spend my points in a fashion to help me survive, so we're gonna have to deal with that for a bit. Okay. Throw him again. He's over there now. Why is he over here now? I have no idea. Kill confirmed. Just wanted to make sure. Just wanted to make sure. I think that guy's actually got a lot of life and health specifically for tutorial reasons. You can't kill him otherwise, sort of thing. Um, you know, let's switch to our sniper rifle and see if we can pot shot the people all the way down here. I have no sniper training, so this is going to be difficult. <laughs> We're going to be using this assault rifle a lot for this early part of the game. Eh. <clears throat> okay, guys. Oh, wait, I don't have to use that. Forward! <laughs> you can do it! Cupid shield! Just stop the geth or die trying. You hear that, Stormy? Die. Okay, uh, you guys maybe should take some cover and not completely die because that would be dumb. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Atta boy. Kill that guy. Oh, and nice. level up, yay. Alright, that was a lot better. And the sensitivity is I can deal with it now. Hey, Caden's gone. Oh, is he? Yeah. Oh, good. That's probably because we died. We died, so the ghost of Caden was at peace. <laughs> the ghost of Caden from my last pet playthrough. <laughs> Let's see. Um, let me go. Shield battery. Because I need that. Screw you guys. Um, Alright. We're good. I need to start putting a lot more points and getting my survivability up. Otherwise, I'm gonna experience a lot of those moments where I'm just eating it. Mm. All right, let's take the happy train to Happy Land. 